When you upgrade now to 19C, the same would apply to 12, 201 and 18, but we talk about upgrades 19C because this is the release you all need to upgrade to. Then we have now the new highly efficient hyper lock lock algorithm. And hyper lock lock is not an invention from Oracle. It's a known algorithm. If you download the slides as PDF, the link will get you to a Wikipedia entry explaining the algorithm a bit more. And with that algorithm, the synopsis shrinks significantly. From the tests I've done and we, what we've seen, we would estimate between factor of 10 to factors of 25. So let's assume we had a terabyte synopsis before, then it makes a huge difference if you have now just a hundred gigabyte consuming than a terabyte before. And it can be even less than that. That is available since 12.201. And actually there are two, um, two behaviors. First behavior is, and this is the default, the coexistence of old and new synopsis. That means, let's say you have 10 partitions, you upgrade now, and after upgrade, you add an 11th partition, then the 10 existing one will keep the old synopsis format, while the 11th one after upgrade gets synopsis created with the hyperlocklock algorithm. This sounds nice at first, but we are not convinced here that this is the best idea. The other option is regathering the synopsis. And this is what we think is much, much better. And I tell you why. So we want to replace the old with the new synopsis. So in the middle of the slide, you see we have a partition table. The table is called orders. We have a partition. And the idea is now it has old synopsis format. We upgrade. And then after upgrade, we enforce now the recreation of the synopsis. This, of course, is costly in terms of not cost for license cost. This is an enterprise edition feature, but for in terms of performance, in terms of also effort, because if you have like 60,000 partitions, it may take a little bit, but trust us, it's worth the effort. Really it is. What you need to do, you drop the old synopsis. So first call here on the slide, DBM stats, delete table stats, stat category synopsis. Don't delete all your stats, but delete the synopsis. Then you choose the hyperlocklock algorithm as standard. And you do this with set table prefs, approximate NDV algorithm, approximate number of distinct values algorithm, hyperlocklock. Now you turn on hyperlocklock. And then you disallow the coexistence of old and new, and you force a regathering, and you set the table prefs to incremental stainless null. Change it later on again, once it's done. But this way you force the database now. You tell it, okay, these statistics are outdated, you need to regather it. And then you get the new ones. Why are we recommending that? We learn from customer cases, when we have the coexistence of old and new, that especially index stats gathering is not good anymore. It's not precise. It leads to a lot of issues. And this is why we came to the conclusion with the customers we worked with that you have to wipe out the old synopsis and you have to enforce the regeneration. Then you need less space afterwards, significantly less space. In that customer case, we really went down from 1.2 terabyte to less than 150 gigabytes, significantly space uh, saving. And it's really way more efficient. So do this even though it's a little bit extra effort.